Hello grade 10s and welcome to this lesson of factorizing the difference and sum of two cubes. Let us start by learning how to identify the sum and difference of two cubes. It's actually very easy. In a difference or sum of two cubes, there will be two cubed numbers separated by a plus or a minus. Now, if you are asked to factorize an expression that looks like that, then you know you need to do a method that you are about to learn. The sum of perfect cubes always factorizes into this form. The first bracket always contains the cube root of the term. In the same way, the difference of perfect cubes always factorizes in this way, with the first bracket also containing the cube root of the term. The second bracket has the square of the first term in the first bracket. The middle term is the product of the two terms in the first bracket multiplied by negative one. And the last term is equals to the square of the second term in the first bracket. Write these down and learn them. Let's do an example together. Factorize 8x cubed plus y cubed. We immediately identify this as the sum of two cubes and know we can begin by opening two brackets. Remember that the first bracket is the cube root of each term. The cube root of 8x cubed is 2x. The cube root of y cubed is y. The first term in the second bracket is the square of the first term in the first bracket. 2x squared is equals to 4x squared. The middle term is calculated by multiplying the two terms in the first bracket and multiplied by negative 1. 2x times y times negative 1 is equal to minus 2xy. The last term in the second brackets is found by squaring the last term in the first brackets. y squared is equals to y squared. This gives us the final answer of open brackets 2x plus y close brackets open brackets 4x squared minus 2xy plus y squared close brackets. This becomes a lot easier with more practice. So let's do another example. Do you think you could do this on your own? Factorize 54x cubed minus 16. Start by looking for a highest common factor. In this case, it is two. We divide each term by two and get two open bracket, 27x cubed minus 8, close bracket. We now recognize that inside that bracket, we have the difference of two cubes. So this needs to be factorized even further. We find the first bracket by cube rooting 27x cubed and 8. This gives us 3x and minus 2. We get the second bracket by squaring 3x and we know that this is 9x squared. The middle term we get by multiplying 3x and negative 2 by each other. And then by negative 1. This gives us plus 6x. The last term we get by squaring the 2 which is 4. Thank you for joining us grade 10s. Remember to try the task video at the end of this section. You'll also be able to learn more about the sum and difference of cubes on our website www.mindset.co.za forward slash learn. Goodbye.